What does your helmet look like? My helmet is purple right now. Today, we're painting helmets. Not really sure how this is gonna go. We've never tried this ourselves personally. I know Claudius has tried it before. A lot of kids tag us in pictures where they've done it themselves. So today, we're gonna be painting the helmets. I'm gonna hydro dip my helmet and Clayton's going to just paint his. So, let's get into it. The first step that I'm gonna do to paint this helmet is obviously cover up all the holes because I don't want liquid spray paint going into the, where my padding and all that is. So, I'm gonna cover up the holes really quick. All right, so I'm using frog tape right now. I know this is a little bit more waterproof than other tapes on the market, so hopefully best results come out of this one. I'm gonna put a few layers of tape over each one of the holes. So I got my helmet all taped up and now we're ready to paint. Hopefully the tape doesn't peel up while I'm hydro dipping it. That'd be, that'd be really bad, that would suck actually. Um, I'm probably gonna hydro dip it pretty basic. I'm thinking that I'm gonna go with a mint color and a pink color, like a light pink. So we're outside, I got my paints. I'm gonna use a pink, like a nice rose pink, and then this teal color, or this mint color. Let's get it. I'm gonna spray these in, and then I'm just gonna pick up the helmet and dip it, so let's go. Oh, I'm getting covered in it. Oh. That looks actually pretty sick. That does look sick. So it's sick, but it's not sick enough. There needs to be more colors. So, I'm gonna spray paint some black in there and this blue, and I'm gonna just kinda go crazy with it. So, let's get to it. Hey, there we go. That looks sick. Oh That's my gosh. Crazy. Wow. And the best part is, like no water got inside of the helmet. Like a little bit did, because it like overflowed. But for the most part, like no water got into it. So, hyped on that. Awesome. All right, so for my helmet, it's gonna be more basic. It's not gonna be really anything crazy. I'm just trying to keep it more simple because I want my helmet to be more like basic, you know, with like the stickers and then have like something on this side, with, which is what we're about to do. So if you guys want to pick up one of these helmets, you can go to the link in our description down below and have a link to, uh, to their website and also their Instagram and everything like that including our promo code that you can use and all that good stuff and if you're too lazy to look into the description it is S1 Scoots and you can just use Undialed as a promo code. Um, so recently we started working with S1. Uh, last week we, up, we uploaded a video talking about just safety and everything like that and just trying to help you guys out just talking about safety and whatnot and um, What's something that's really really cool about S1 is that they're actually a skateboard company and they, uh, they've they never worked with scooter riders or anything like that and they hit us up and we're like, hey guys, we would love to work with you and all this stuff so we're, we're working together and bringing these helmets into the scootering world and so it's awesome that they're actually seeing that scootering is becoming a big mainstream sport and it's sick that they're on board and helping us and helping you guys and all that good stuff. So let's get into the video. This, I found this at their warehouse. I thought it was really sick because it's like a stencil off one of just their helmet boxes. And I asked them if I could just have one of the boxes and so they hooked me up with this. So I'm just gonna use the stencil basically to put it right here. And I'm just gonna use like a couple different colors to put it together like so. And I'm just gonna tape it up so it's solid and we're gonna get to painting. Uh. Hmm. Is that gonna hold? <laughs> Absolutely not. I'm just gonna hold it. <laughs> I'm so over. Look how colorful this is. Look how many painting videos we've done on this. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna kind of use this wall to kind of just hold it like so and then literally just spray paint it. Oh, oh no, it fell. Oh, okay, all right. So I'm gonna use this, this gray first as like a um, main tone, I guess.
My whole goal is to kind of make it runny. Just a little bit. Oh no. Ooh. That looks so sick. Very simple, but yet looks tight. Ooh, that looks tight. Good morning. It's time to reveal the helmets. Alright, so this is mine. It actually turned out really sick. And also I like how it like blends in and whatnot. Looks sick. It's morning and we're gonna get the helmet real quick. So, here's the helmet right here. Oh, it's kind of dark. Ooh, here's the helmet right here. This looks pretty sweet. All right, I'm gonna take it inside and unwrap it and see how it looks. All right, so we're here and we're about to take off the tape right now. So basically, the hydro dip only got to like around like the bottom, which is okay because I'm planning to cover this thing in stickers and I might do something with the top depending on how it looks with a paint marker. Who knows, I'm, I'm just gonna unwrap it and see how it looks and then decide from there. Let's get to it. If you guys want to get an S1 helmet yourself and do your own painting and coloring and I don't know, do your own design to it, uh, make sure to use promo code UNDIALED at S1 at, on their website and that'll be on the screen right here. So go check it out, go get yourself a six certified helmet that'll save your life. And if you don't think it'll save your life, go watch our last video explaining how it will save your life. So eat, go watch it. So as you can see, there's still like a lot of purple on it, but I'm okay with this actually because I'm planning to like get some paint markers and color around it and make it sick. So I'm gonna get some paint markers right now and just start doodling on it, so. Hopefully it turns out sick, hopefully it turns out how I'm envisioning it in my head. If it doesn't, oh well, I'll still wear it. <laughs> so yeah, let me get some mate markers and I'll see you guys in a second. Let's get to business. So I got my stickers and my markers are in here somewhere. What markers are these? Ooh, perfect colors right off the bat. All right, I'm gonna start coloring around and I'm keen to see how it looks, so let's get to it. All right, so I colored a little bit with the marker so far, and I have basically the whole top of it done. Um, it looks a little bit like kind of gross right now, I'm not gonna lie but hopefully with a little bit more coloring and some stickers, the helmet's gonna look sick in the end. I like how it like comes down and like kind of looks like it's draining down and matches like the paint, and that's what that's the theme I'm gonna try to keep throughout the whole helmet, is like the melting theme. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep coloring a little bit and I'm stoked to see how it's gonna transpire and turn out. I'm gonna use a purple now, just cause I think I've used enough pink for, for this moment. So, yep, here goes purple. And what I'm gonna do with the purple is I'm gonna have the purple draining from like the top, because I have the pink kind of draining from like these holes. I'm gonna have the purple draining from like this hole and coming out. So, that's my idea. Hopefully it looks sick. All right, so I think I'm done drawing on the helmet. I think it looks pretty sick. And all I have left on it, and all I have left on it that needs to be covered up is like the back area back here and the front area. And I'm just gonna use stickers for that. So I'm gonna start cutting on some stickers and I'm starting to see what it looks like. 
putting on this district sticker right here, this vinyl sticker. Shout out to District Scooters. If you guys don't know, I am I ride for District Scooters. A lot of people don't know that. I thought everyone knew that, but I guess not. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna put some District stickers on here. Yeah, it's gonna look tight. I think this one looks sick, like right here. Make sure you don't get any air bubbles or creases when you're putting on vinyl stickers, or else it'll look majorly ugly. And if you do get any creases, make sure to smooth them out, so that way they're less ugly. So I kind of just want to use stickers that go with the theme of the helmet. So I'm going to be using a lot of stickers that are like this color and pink and red and purple, but I'm not going to be using a lot of other colors just because I want to see what it looks like to have a like a helmet covered in just like one color of sticker. So maybe I'll put some yellow on there, but that's about as far as I'll go just for eagle. So I've put a few stickers on my helmet so far. I've put in quite a few scooter from stickers in the back, the district one. My own personal Willy sticker that I designed a while ago. If you guys want these stickers, let me know. I don't know if you like them. Um, then I have the Scooter Prime stickers, A Town sticker, Rush Skate Park stickers, um, some old, old, old district stickers, um, S1 helmet stickers, and I'm gonna put a few more stickers around here. I have an Attic sticker, and then I just gotta get the front little bit right here, and then we'll be covered and we'll be good. So I'm gonna continue putting on some stickers. I have the helmet basically all stickered up right now. I put some Elsa stickers in the front. I put some more S1 stickers around. I have the district, my sticker. It looks pretty sick so far. So right now I'm just gonna cut out the stickers and yeah, and it should look pretty cool. I should probably be using a better knife than this than a kitchen knife, but I don't know where the razor blade is. All right, so here's the completed helmet. Um, it looks so sick in my own opinion. I really like how it turned out. So, yeah, I'm super stoked on it. The top looks awesome, how it kind of like drools down or drips down. And then, yeah, completely on top and just working around. It looks super nice, I like it a lot. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of um, showing my how I did my helmet and how Clayton did his helmet. So if you guys do decorate your helmet, make sure to tag me in the pictures. Tag at Undialed TV and tag at White Trash Willie and tag at Clayton Lindley. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace out, Girl Scouts.